still talk real quick about WWE 2K25, and I may do numerous videos like this. People wait too long to actually speak. Even the top creators wait too long to speak on matters when it comes to WWE 2K, and I'm, I'm not wasting no time. One of the things that no one ever talks about, you want to praise GMO, but you always be forgetting one thing about GMO. And I wonder, like, are you actually playing GMO with creations? Because when it comes to creations, you cannot add creations. You cannot add onto your roster outside of the DLC. When it comes to cars, you cannot import or export. There needs to be an ability where somewhere in GN Assistant, where we can go in here and, um, you know, shake up our roster. But we cannot do that. If you go to manage roster, there's nothing in there. You can talent scout, you can manage, but only for what you apply. The only time that you can do anything when it comes to cause, and there's another, is at the very beginning. And see, that brings up another problem too. Unless you delete your GMO, you are you cannot <laughs> erase that particular car that you added to your GMO. Why isn't anyone talking about this? Let's skip this real quick. Let's skip this. So you can see what I'm talking about here. I'm just doing this real quick. Okay, so you have a draft pool, right? You can make it custom. But you cannot do anything into this pool after the fact. You cannot edit it. You cannot do anything to it. It's, it's, it's bad. Well, if you, of course, if you view it, you can then edit it, all right? But after that, you stuck with it until you delete whatever you can't add on to it or not. You should be able to go in there just like you can with universe mode, add people, take them off your roster, things like that. Why can't we do that? You said you got like JBL right now. He has a contract. Um, I have him contracted. You can navigate list and values can sort them um this one's already done so i can't even change that one i can't even change that one so i can't even edit the one that i had but previously i can't even edit that one let me make sure because i don't think i can edit it yeah i can't even edit it after you've done done it you can't edit so it's locked in. I can't edit that. Now I can go back in here and change if I want Undertaker active or not. Things like that. His, his roles. But outside of that, you can't do that. And that needs to change. When it comes to WWE 2K25, let's get this GMO stuff right. Because this is, this is bad. Speak up. Let 2K know that in WWE 2K25, we need to the ability to edit our GM roster with cause even better. See, I'm only showing you right now. I'm kind of only showing you, uh, you know, the main guys. But of course, your cause will show up in here, right? So, yeah, that needs to change. That needs to change. Like I said, your cause will show up in here as well. I don't know why none of my calls show up right now, but. Uh, I don't think it's glitch. I don't think it's glitch. Yeah, that needs to change though. Yeah, they go to customs. All right, see right here? So like, if I wanna make Sean Spears active, I can do that in the beginning, but then outside of making him active in the beginning, unless I delete my entire GM mode, I can't adjust, I can't edit, I can't take them out to add a new Sean Spears, et cetera, et cetera, or just take them off so I can delete the Sean Spears that I don't want to use anymore on my game, period. Anywhere on my game, period. So they need to do something about that. I thought they was going to do it last year. They didn't do it last year. thought they was going to do it this year. They didn't do it this year. So it's like, when are you going to do it? 2K25, no more excuses. Change this. Fix this. Make it work the way it should work. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next show, next video. I'm out of here. Peace!